Hey guys, it is Callie here, and I am here to um, let you know what I think about these crazy ch challenges that have been going on. Um, first off, let me say to Kelly, I have not read 1984, so therefore I do need to borrow it, but um, that's okay with me. I, I wasn't a big reader in high school. I know that's hard to believe because now I can't go without reading something every day, um, and that goes to answer part of Crystal's challenge. But I will say that, um, that man, I, I do like dystopia too. I think it's, I think it's fun. Um, Kelly, I have a challenge for you um, as far as a summer book read that I'll get back to you on. But I do want to answer your question about fairy tales. I haven't read Ella Enchanted. I really haven't read a lot of offbeat um, fairy tales like, you know, I don't want to say skewed, but just altered maybe is a better word for it. Um, I haven't read a bunch, but I will say that uh, there is a series called the um, the Iron King. The Iron, well, it's a series called I think it's the Iron Fay series, but the books are the Iron King, the Iron Daughter, the Iron Queen, and then there's also a book coming out called The Iron Knight by Julie Cagua, and I'm hoping I'm pronouncing that correctly. And it actually is not a skewed fairy tale so much as it is taking characters from a, mid a Midsummer Night's Dream and actually using them in her book. Uh, I, I love it. I think it's fascinating and fun. And I think that a lot of her readers really love those books, hence them being her readers. Anyway, uh, so that's kind of as close as I've gotten with that. Uh, but again, I'm not, I love fantasy, but I'm not a big fairy tale person. I don't know why. Uh, so then moving on uh, to, I will go to Stephanie now because I haven't addressed you yet. Uh, girl, I just love the fact that you could not pick one actor that you wanted to interview um, because I am so broad in the people that I want to talk to and interview. Uh, as far as actors and then cast or crew, I'm going to pick one from each. That one cast member, one crew member. Um, and the first cast member I'm going to choose is someone no one has mentioned so far, and that is Lee Pace, who is playing Garrett in Breaking Dawn. And part of the reason is because he's hot. Shh, don't tell my husband. But another thing that I love about him is he was on this TV show called Pushing Daisies that I loved. And, um, and I can't wait to see how he goes from playing this really nice guy that makes pies to a vampire. So I just think it would be so fun to talk to him. Um, another person I want to interview is Bill Condon. I don't think I could ever get enough questions in to one interview with him, so I'm definitely going to stick with him. He's brilliant, and, uh, and I think he's going to do brilliant things with Breaking Dawn. I am very excited about all of the different, gosh, all of the different movies that are going to be coming out, all the ones that the options have been bought and hopefully will be coming out. But, uh, but those are the two I'm going to stick with. And, um, and then Crystal asked about what we read, or what we did read, sorry, read when we were teenagers. I didn't read a lot, as, except for what the schools made us read. You know, um, A Tale of Two Cities, Red Badge of Courage. Uh, I think I really started getting into reading in college because in high school I was an athlete and didn't have a lot of time. It sounds so bad. Like, I wasn't a dumb jock or anything, I just didn't have a lot of time. So, um, yeah, college, uh, you know, read some Jane Austen, some Charlotte Bronte, and, um, and then kind of fell in love with murder mystery then. Um, gosh, Iris Johansson was like one of the first um, authors that I started checking stuff out from my library and waiting for the next one to come out. Gosh, there's just a lot, but, I, you know, I, I love to read now, and that's what counts, right? So um, I'm not going to throw out another challenge just yet to you folks. I'm going to, um, to work on this reading challenge, summer reading challenge for Kelly. And then as soon as I think of a really good daunting challenge uh, for the rest of you, I will uh, make sure to make a video. So you guys have a great week and I will talk to you soon.